be in the name of the Lord, brethren and sisters. Good morning, good afternoon. And good evening, as the time implies, wherever you're watching or listening to this play. Happy New Month to you, the first day of the month of October. We've just entered into the last quarter of the year 2023. And this is the word of God concerning you, even as God even spoke unto Jeremiah. In Jeremiah 1 3, God said unto him, What have you seen? He said, I have seen an armor trade. And he went that said, What have you seen again? He said, I have seen a city in port, leading towards north. He said, God said, I will hasten my word to perfect it. I don't know what God has shown to you. I don't know what God has told you. I don't know what your spirit has caught in the atmosphere, in the spirit realm from the beginning of the year. As you enter into the last quarter of this year, this is the word of God concerning you. God is going to perform and perfect and establish all his good word concerning you in Jesus' name. How do I know and how will you know? For God has said it is not a man that he should lie. Now the son of man that need to repent. Whatever that comes out of the mouth of God cannot go unto him void. I pray in agreement with your spirit as you are watching, listening. Every word that God had deposited into your spirit since the beginning of year 2023, I pray right now that God will activate it. God will bring it to pass in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I command the hand of God to rest upon you that and that word will be activated in the name of Jesus. Ah, in your career, in your marital life, in your businesses and investment, I say all the goodness of God, the good thoughts of God, the plans of God, the will and desire of God concerning you in the last days of this year, it will come to pass in Jesus' name. The end of a thing is better than the beginning. The end of this year will be greater for you. It will be glorious for you. It will be of a blessing unto you. In the name of Jesus, where you have experienced stagnation, I pray the hand of God will move you forward. That hand will push you forward. Where you are getting into dead end and dead location, God will move you forward. Where you have been rejected, where you have been abandoned, I command the doors to be open unto you in the name of Jesus. Because God is not a liar. You are in his plan, you are in his thoughts, you are in his mind. When Ivan and Earth were made, he had you in his mind. I pray for you that all the plans of God concerning you. According to Jeremiah 29, 11, he said, I know the thought that I have to also. They are the thought of goodness and not of evil to take you to an eternal end. The end of this year will be glorious for you. As you are listening to me, to your husband, your wife, your, your fiancé, to you as individual, I say you will end this year well. In the name of Jesus Christ, the word of God say, I will activate my word. I will hasten it. I will hurry to bring it to pass. God will bring this word to pass in your life. As you wait on him, he will not put you to shame. As you, did, as you continually wait on God, you will not be ashamed in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Your waiting and trusting in God will not be in vain until I come your way again. Tally in his presence, you are the next story to be told. God bless you.